hello. Hiya. Hi. Doing something a bit different. We've come to a city, uh, Lincoln actually. So we're going to have a look around um, and show you some sights. So we're now making our way up steep hill towards the castle. So we finally now reach the top of Steep Hill. French at the same time, they made a bit of a tactical error. They decided to... Right, we're now inside Lincoln Castle. We're just about to head to the uh, Victorian prison and the Magna Carta section. Right, What do we have here then? She's found it. She loves dressing up. For <laughs> things to do. <laughs> right. Oh, boy, oh, my neck! Oh, it's pig in code in here, isn't it? Oh. What are you in for then? I didn't wash my pants for a year. Really? Yeah. You're absolutely crazy. Do you know how long you could go down for that? Six years. <laughs> hello, hello, what do we have here? Hello. Who are you? Julie. And what you in here for? <laughs> I didn't wash my boots properly. You what? My boots. Oh, I thought you said something <laughs> else, Julie. <laughs> Boats. 
three years in here. That's a bit harsh. I know. I've got kids though as well. I got six for not washing my knickers. Really? Yeah. That's absolutely disgusting. I know. Totally the two year old. <laughs> Outside here, see those are castle walls, and that's where we're going to be going to shortly. This is an example of Victorian segregation and isolation um, and it's the only example left in the world. So the reason that those doors are so high is because they couldn't see each other because it was literally just solid, solitary confinement. And reflection. These people, fake people, sat in these Stalls literally just scared the hell out of me because I thought they were real people. <laughs> but they do look real, look. Welcome to the prison chapel. The warm supreme prison So this is where the Magna Carta is, um, the staff actually told us that um, Magna Carta is not on show today, um, but this is where you would normally go if you wanted to see it. It's amazing, amazing views. A bit windy, but really good all the same. A bit windy, a bit rainy. Yeah. But the walls go all the way around. Don't look down. Why? It's a bit far. Ooh. Yeah, I see what you mean. Just down here there is a, a little graveyard uh, of some of the prisoners who died of execution or natural causes. This is the view of the back of the Victorian prison where we've just been. Up we go. 
Wow, another amazing view. Another spiral staircase, making our way up the tower. That was a trek. Hello. Oh, but yeah, look. Great views of the castle walls, the Victorian prison down there. Lincoln Cathedral again. But it looks really pretty as well, lit up at night. Really, really pretty. Oh dear. So it was Lincoln Cathedral here. Spectacular building. Looks like there's a bit of work going on outside today. Let's head on in. Making our way out of the cathedral now. We've just come down to the Lincoln's Medieval Bishop's Palace. It is closed today, unfortunately, but we have been down here a few years back. We, did, we came to check it out a few years back. I think it was back in 2015. And it is definitely worth the visit. Just done a bit of shopping while I'm here as well. Thought, why not? And there's a good selection of uh, restaurants and bars as well. So we've got Nando's, Prezzo, Ask Italian, Wagamama. Um, yeah, it's pretty cool down here. So we're at Brayford Waterfront, we're just having a sit down, we've been walking all day long and we need some time to relax. Yeah, it's very relaxing down here, just sat on a bench, looking at the water, mm. watching the world go by. Looking at the boats, Yeah, the old train going past in the background. Yeah, because the, the train station is not too far from here, so you can see the trains just opposite where we are going past every now and then. And then we'll think about heading home. Mm.
so that marks the end of our day visiting Lincoln and it's been a good one yet again. Uh, we hope you enjoy watching the video and please like, share and subscribe. Thank you. Bye.